We are ready to begin. The success of the Hidden God's errand will depend, I think, upon secrecy. We must ensure that the Orcs of Mirkwood do not learn of Mazog's presence beneath the eaves, or they will surely launch an attack upon us in such number we cannot repel them. To the southeast are two forts from which the Orcs of Mirkwood maintain a watch upon the first part of the forest. Search any coffers you find in Malthu Umer and Ashur's Malflug for Orc communications that defeat and defeat any of the Torach that you find in the Merkwe eaves as you do so. If you can return to me with any plans or messages that mention Mazog, we can determine how to proceed. If they are aware that we have brought him into Mor out of Moria and into Merkwood, we may need to act quickly to survive. Well, there is that. So, search for a coffer and defeat orcs and goblins. I suppose we can do that. Anything here that... Mind my words, traveler. Yes, we took the orcs by surprise when we landed and quickly routed them into the forest. However, we believe they may either have another camp nearby or are preparing a retaliatory assault, for we have recently seen goblin scouts on occasion. We have dispatched our own patrols to find their camps, but have thus far been unsuccessful. If you would, scour the murkies for these elusive scouts. Perhaps they may carry some clue as to the camp's whereabouts. They have a mastery of stealth, so it may be difficult to find them. Also, you should speak with Tethafel and Franka here in Echasarion, just in case they have tasks. Well, I'll decide if any of those are blending in with what I'm about to do. See, what do you need me to do? Might you spare a moment of your time? Plant this banner at Falug. Oh, okay, I suppose I could do that. And let's see, so plant a banner and up there we have. What do you need? Mind my words, traveler. Yeah, if you have a moment, Petronella, I would speak with you. Our forces landed recently upon the shore and drove off the orcs after a mighty battle. However, many dark creatures have been seen lurking upon the sh shore still. Many wargs and Kriban roam the Merkeves, undoubtedly spying for the enemy at Dol Guldor. The eyes of Dol Guldor must be blinded to our movements. If you would purge the Krabine and wargs from these shores, I would be most grateful. Be wary upon your task. For goblin scouts also roam these beaches, and they may ambush you. Don't worry, I'm a master of stealth, and I'm hunting the goblins. <laughs> I see we already have some of these wargs around. One type of scout, we might as well get rid of the wargish type scouts. And perhaps we'll find some of those goblin type scouts also while we're at it. One down, many more to go. Hold on. I think I sent some... Aha! Well then. We know what to do with Goblin Scouts, don't we? See? Hmm. That's what we do with Goblin Scouts. I claim this outpost for the Maladrim. There you go. Anything left to do? Oh yeah, of course. I claim this boar for my dinner. There you go. What do you say to that? Now let's cross across the river and see if we can find those plans. I found one of the orc camps and I also found 
An orc, how about that? And we need to deal with some of these if we're going to do anything, as well as to find that alleged document. Anyone else in here? Orcs all over the place, I think. All over the place. And hopefully, we'll take... Well, I'm sure we'll have no trouble taking care of enough orcs. The big trouble is going to be finding where they keep their orders. Can I distract them? Reveal the weakness. Stab them in the back. Strike them dead. Yeah, like that. And they'll never know I was here. Now, where would they keep a chest? Well, maybe we should ask this archer? We ask him politely? Nah! Yeah, I don't think he's up for a polite conversation. Not at all. Especially after I do that to him. Ah, look at that. A chest. Also an orc. Hmm. Whoopsie daisy. That's not good. I was hoping he didn't have any company. But I guess I'm going to have to live with that. Well, I hope I live with it. Ah, well, he certainly didn't live with it. There you go. Join your friend. Quickly. And there you go with that. Now, let's take care of that chest. And we'll have what we came for. Ooh. Didn't see that one. Well, yeah, unfortunately, I guess telling people riddles just tracks the attention of other people nearby. There you go, your turn. Now, let's see what's in here. Hmm? Inside the coffers, you find a letter addressed to Mazog. Well, it's addressed to him, I guess. Oh, hello! I didn't see you! Well, glad to meet you! How are you doing? Not very well, I see. Ha! I found another one of those goblin scouts. Well, we'll deal here with him quickly enough, I hope. There you go. Ooh. I think that's dealt with enough of those. I dealt with several of those wargs and birds. How can I be of service? Very good, Petronella. It will be long ere the eyes of Dol Guldur will be fixed upon us. Perhaps by then, the rest of our forces will have joined us. We could only hope. We could only hope. Now, what else have we got? Okay. Yes, I've pla I planted the flag. How can I be of service? Welcome back, Petronella. You have planted the banner? Then all is well. Once the threat of the siege is lessened, Lord Celeborn will muster a greater force to join us. All right. Good. And I dealt with those goblin scouts. How can I be of service? These tokens bespeak of several encampments, Petronella. I will send scouts out immediately to find them. Remain here, though. I may have a task for you. Yeah, but I may not have time to do that task. We'll have to see. What is this task? Mind my words, traveler. Yeah. Hmm. 
Yeah, Petronella, while you were gone, one of our scouts discovered the location of the orc encampment to the south and another one to the north. However, these tokens that you brought to me belong to four different tribes or companies. I fear there are other camps we may not have found yet. Right. Well, unfortunately, I have another matter I need to attend to. Alright, I found this letter. Actually, let me see what it says. Hail Mazog, Lord of the Pit and Ruler of the Caves. The bearer of this communication has been proven in battle. His strength measured among the very highest of my warriors. I gift him to your service in token of the friendship of the orcs in Berkwood. I have here affixed the mark of Malfulug. May we meet in battle beneath the yellow leaves some day soon and share a cup of stories of death and glory. Well, Malfulug is not going to do that because I killed him on the way there, didn't I? Hmm, well, too bad for Malfulug. Let me see what you have found. You found a report addressed to Mazak in the coffer of the orc leader of Asher's Malfulug? Uh, Malfulug? Uh, let me see what it says. Hmm. Fortune is with us, my adventurous burglar. These orcs do not yet know that we have captured Mazog and brought him into Mirkwood. They think he resides still in Moria. The errand of the hidden guard remains a secret. A problem arose while you were away. Luth Greyhammer, a dwarf of Bruin's company, has becoming increasingly agitated about the plans of the Golden Host. Speak with him here in Echad Sirion, if you would, and assure him that we are doing all that we may to make his journeys a safe one. His family has many grievances against the orcs, but I fear the Greyhammers may do us ill if they do not keep their heads about them. Well... Dwarves keeping hens about them. Yeah, right. Mm. Hello there, Luth. At last, someone who will listen to me. I may have known it would be you, Petronella. You are held in great esteem by my lords, Bosi and Broger, and have proven yourself a friend of the Iron Garrison. You will be a friend too of the Grey Hammers, right? These elves do not have the experience with orcs that we grey hammers do. Oh, they seem understanding enough when I recount the many grievances my family have suffered in the hands of Mazog and his forebearers, but I can tell they think I exaggerate. Do I exaggerate the wounding of my grandfather Thormal at Anzu Bizar, who walked with a limp ever after? or the curse levied against my father Tondri by Bog himself, that he never again find valuable ore in the deeps. I just want these elves to acknowledge how dangerous Mazag is, even in captivity, and to post a Greyhammer sentry wherever he is being kept. You go back and tell Alfimbras that. My family deserves the honor after all the hurts Mazag and his kin have wrought on me. You, you realize that these elves have been fighting orcs for thousands of years? You, you do realize that, right? Okay, and just wanted to be sure. Yeah. Well, that's quite a list of <coughs> grievances. Mazog will account for all slights in time, both real and imagined. Yes, I admire the determination of the Grey Hammers, and I am sure that Luth and the rest of the family will ha be a great help to the Golden Host. But I hope he will spend more time with his duties and less time explaining the various grievances he bears against orcs. We have all suffered at their hands and lose no more than the rest of us. A Cardor may say he has suffered less than some, but he will account for all slights in time. Rydir spoke with me while you sought the dwarf. It is time to bring Mazog deeper into Mirkwood. And what will we find as we venture deeper? We will find that out in the next episode. 
of Piney Plays, The Burglar.